Hi, this is Cindy Rang from the Fabric Patch, and we just have a quick little addendum to our um, freezer paper applique. I forgot to mention how to do um, a weird little convex or concave point um, because we have several people that are people that are doing the quilters canvas panels, and if you look at this. Panel. It's just a, a fun little applique project because it's got bias stems, it's got leaves, some flowers, some perfect circles, and it has this little pot right here. So this little pot, I did that using freezer paper. Ooh, here it is. So if you go back to the other one with the freezer paper, it explains the whole thing, but I just wanted you to see this. When you come into the corner here, what you're going to do is just make that little snip. Do you see that little snip right there? and then you're gonna go ahead and, and fuse that down. You just wanna make sure that you have enough space there so that you don't have a raw edge, but then again, once you're done with that, you're gonna do that exact same thing. Pull your freezer paper out. Oh, your corners, that was the same as what I showed you on the leaves. You're just gonna go ahead and pull that out. You could give it an extra little press if you want to, but see our nice little crisp points everywhere. And then you'll go ahead and glue that down. And then I just wanted to show you this. I did find this other sample. Um, this is this pot was all done by freezer paper applique, and again, that's that little stitch. So when you're stitching around by hand, again, the whole key is that you're not going to be able to see it. And the reason that you can't see it is because the thread that we're using is this 80 weight orophil thread. And so, gosh, even if I, even if my stitch was terrible, you'd never be able to see that thread or the hole that the size 11 straw needle made. So what's nice about this is your stitch doesn't have to be perfect. It's all in the thread and the needle that you use. And then you just do your little stitching around that and you're good to go. All right, now I really am done and have fun with your, um, freezer paper applique.